So here's the thing. Some people are not going to like this video because I'm going to be saying some things that are, well, a little bit difficult for some people to hear. Stay tuned. Let's hear what I've got to say. Hello, my name's Joe, Joe Leach. My background is in user experience. In fact, I've got 12 years of working in user experience and 17 years working in product management, product strategy, digital strategy, those worlds. And I've got two stories for you today that talk about why user experience in itself, customer experience, there shouldn't be a job for somebody which is head of user experience. There shouldn't be a job for somebody which is head of customer experience. Those two jobs shouldn't exist in an organization. And I'm going to explain to you why. The first story I came across, and this is really a catalyst for me moving away from user experience, was I heard the story of the mills in the north of England about 150 years ago. Electricity had just come onto the scene and electricity was transformative. This was the Industrial Revolution. Electricity powered industry was going to power industry further than it ever could have before. Mills are run on steam power, water power. So electricity came along. And how did how did these mill owners approach this? Well, they hired a head of electricity to implement this. They hired a young man, paid them well. That young man sat on the board and their job was to implement electricity across the mill, across the series of mills in the northeast. They spent a lot of money and time with this individual putting electricity in. They could work 24 hours a day because they had electric lighting. They could have two shifts. Maintenance was easy. Electricity truly transformed these businesses and it was done through a head of electricity. Now, us looking back 150 years later, that seems like an anachronism to us. A head of electricity, I mean, electricity we just take for granted. It's just there. Sockets around our homes, around our businesses. A modern business would not have a head of electricity. That job simply wouldn't exist in many of the organisations that we work in today. Of course not. It seems ridiculous. Yet it did 150 years ago. A head of customer experience, a head of user experience, it seems like anachronism already right now. You don't need one person to be responsible for that. You need everybody to be responsible for that. And that brings me to the second story. So during the 1980s, the um, Russian interior minister came to visit the United States of America and he was being driven through from the airport through downtown Washington, D.C. And they drove him through a typical main street. There were all these shops, with all these things in them and they passed a couple of bakeries and what he noticed about these bakeries there were no queues or lines of people outside there was plenty of bread on the shelves and when he got to see his opposite number in the US he sat him down and he said you must introduce me to your head of bread your head of bread is doing a fantastic job there's so much bread around that they, they must tell me what their secret is I must meet this man and of course again to us that seems like a complete anachronism to have a head of bread for for a country because again Everybody was responsible. The small, each baker was given the responsibility for making their own bed. The supply chain ran itself to a certain extent. And that's the way that we should look at modern user experience. It should be everybody should be responsible for doing that. There doesn't need to be a head of bread. There doesn't need to be a head of electricity. There doesn't need to be a head of user experience. That needs to be shared and that job needs to be shared by everybody. And when it is shared by everybody, there's plenty of it around. If everybody's responsible for customer and user experience, it'll get done. If just one person is, they be, ultimately become a bottleneck, a figurehead, and it's not everybody's responsibility. It's just one person's responsibility. That's why I moved away from user experience, because again, it's becoming my responsibility. I didn't want it to be that. Now I spend my time coaching and working with teams to make better choices, better decisions, rather than doing the user experience for them, I help support it so everybody in the organisation does from the C-suite down to the teams that everybody is customer focused and they're all pushing in the right direction. We don't need a head of bread. You don't need a head of bread. You most certainly don't need a head of user experience. Thank you very much for your time. My name's Joe, Joe Leach. If you like this video, please share it on Twitter, LinkedIn, subscribe, like. I'm going to be sharing lots more of this content on my channel, on my blog. Thank you very much for your time and I'll see you again soon. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, little dude. That's my dog, by the way. Bye now.